Okay, so maybe that's not that impressive, but let me roll the intro and show you guys what I'm getting at here. What's up you guys and welcome back to my channel and yes today I am going to teach you guys how to levitate on Photoshop. It's an easy way that I learned a few years ago and to do this you're just going to need your tripod, a stool, and a camera. So the first thing you're going to want to do is set your camera up on the tripod with a 10 second timer to give yourself time to pose on the stool. Then you're going to want to remove yourself and the stool and snap a picture of just the background. Then you're going to move those images into Photoshop. So let's get started. So now that we have our images, the first thing we want to do is place our background image on first. Then we're going to put the one of us sitting on the stool on top of that one. We're going to take the background eraser tool and start erasing the chair. So the next thing I like to do is to erase some of the area to make it look more believable. And it's just as easy as that. Now it looks like I'm levitating. So let's say you mess up and accidentally take out a piece of the tree that you didn't mean to take out. You can hit this clone stamp tool, hit alt, and select an area of the tree and then color in that area without the alt button. What that basically does is exactly what it says. It's a clone stamp so it will take that area that you select and replicate it in the area that you messed up. So now the tree's back filled in. So there you have it. It's as easy as that. Once you have it in Photoshop, it's just using that eraser tool to erase the chair that you were sitting on and it makes it look like you're levitating. Um, after you do all that, you can save it, throw it into Lightroom and fix up any blemishes or any area that kind of looks like the chair is still visible. You can do that all in Lightroom or you can do it all in Photoshop. It's totally up to you. So I hope you liked this video. If any of you guys do try this, please send it to me or tag me in it on Instagram so I can check them out. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.